Hey, how's it going, everybody? Uh, my name's Todd. I'm going to start doing some videos. Um, I collect a lot of stuff, and I thought I would just start doing some videos because I don't use what I call my real money, like from my job, for my collection. I use recycled money, so I sell stuff um, from my collection so I can buy new and different things I'm into. Um, basically, I've been collecting for about 14 years. And I collect, I first started with G.I. Joe. I love G.I. Joe. There's some of the new um, classified stuff. Uh, but I started in the 118th scale and the 4-inch figures. And I got started when my parents found some of my stuff from the 80s when I was a kid. Uh, they had a couple totes left over and then they were like, hey, get rid of these. So I went on to eBay like 14 years ago and a local guy was grabbing them and introduced me into the world of action figure collecting. Um, so then I went ahead and just went full force into it. It was about when the 25th anniversary stuff was coming out and there was just tonnage at the stores. And I mean, I was going into Target and my shopping cart just had toys falling out of it. It was, it was so awesome. It was just like being back in the 80s. Uh, but I collect Lego. So here's a little Lego city my kids and I have been putting together. We're not finished. And there's Try my everybody. girls. We're not finished. <laughs> no. There was a messiness. It's some, still some stuff are not for the city. Being put together. And what I'm doing now is I'm transitioning from 118th scale to 112th. I really like the six inch figures better. I've been collecting the black series since they started. I think they started in 07. I'm sure if I'm, I'm not really knowledgeable on all the dates and everything. So I'm going to probably misstate a lot of things, but I've been collecting them since they started. I just recently in the last couple of years got into legends and Hasbro, of course, started the Jejo Classified line. That really put me over on being able to let loose the um, 118th scale 4-inch G.I. Joes and, get, and offload them. I mean, I've, I've had hundreds. Um, so I've basically been selling them so I can buy Lego and buy my 112th scale stuff. Daddy! And... I guess my daughter wants to say something. What? Okay, being goofy. So like, um, what I kind of go in, so I'm always buying, um, Legends, Black Series, and as everyone knows, uh, Hasbro can be a pain in the butt on how they... Uh, release that stuff to the collectors. Um, I know a lot of us are really upset with the G.I. Joe Classified. Like, there's some of the... Like, I'm missing, of course, the Target exclusives. I don't have the Vipers, Firefly. I've heard um, Major Blood's going to be one, so I probably won't get him. But there's just so much out there to collect anyway, so it's not a huge deal. But anyway, one of the things I wanted to do is um, I got this new Lego, the ice cream truck, and I didn't get the box. I'm not sure what number it is, but it's pretty cool. So as you can see, it comes with two many figures and it comes with a dog also but i'm not sure where i put the dog oh i know where it is it's okay we don't need it everybody's seen the dogs so it's got a sliding uh, window and the boy comes with a helmet and he also comes with a hair piece yes and this uh it's pretty cool how they did this i like the window and then also you know, for playability, they um, just knock that off. But uh, 
you know, the side swings open so you can have access into the back with the ice cream cones and whatnot. So like a robber could come and open the door and steal it? Daddy, what yeah. is it? No robber's gonna steal it. Uh -huh. All the robbers are over in the corner. They're actually trying to make a plan. Make a plan. Yeah, they're right here. Trying to make a plan. They're gonna but... get they're gonna get the bank. Stuff. The, the Daddy. Right. Gonna... Yeah, it's still in progress. Um, I'm gonna put the. I have the. I have the police station, um, and I'm gonna put that here. What? What are you gonna put here? And then, um, I'm not sure yet, but then, as you can um, see, um, I could. I need a bigger room because, but this is a good size uh, Lego setup. I. Can I show them? But, um, can I show them this yeah, we have. The back. Of the building, we have a movie theater, a corner garage, a department, and a pet shop, and more de on another department. And we have a vet. We have. We are going to build a police station. And um, I, yeah, um, what's I'm the other like setup we we moved. <clears throat> I've moved a couple times, and I'm yeah. um, sorry. We haven't really been able to get. The collection set up ever but um like i have here's some of my black series uh i love the hasbro hasbro did some vehicles um for them the with 118th scale i went crazy i mean i had hundreds of vehicles from gi joe and whatnot and it's just been been trying to get rid of them and and uh it just takes up so much space but uh they have. <laughs> we're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> There's some of my stuff, but what I what I plan on doing is um, going through when I go through totes and stuff. I'll probably make videos just to document my toys. I just have so much. I mean, when I open it, uh, there's been totes that I might open. I haven't been in them for years, and it's just like, oh my gosh, I have this Lego set, or oh my gosh, I have this. Uh, ATST from you know Walmart exclusive or and uh, it's just crazy you know it's um, but it's cool it keeps me out of trouble but I'm gonna go ahead and uh, sign off and I will be making more videos and doing uh, some cool stuff in the future all right take it easy.